Deb Shell, and I'm a community strategist. I help people build online communities, create connection and belonging, and develop a sense of purpose for their community. Most of my work is done on um, the Mighty Networks platform. And if you're not familiar with Mighty Networks, today I am going to do a little bit of a demo about Mighty Networks because I feel like uh, there are so many new features to explore and check out. So I'm going to just do a couple of demos on a couple different features of the new uh, platform options. So I'm going to use my own community to show you a few things. And the first thing I'm going to show you is a lot of clients um, don't know how to customize these global features. And so these four top icons are the global. Everything else you see is in a space, but these four things are global. And so you can actually customize these settings by going to that gear icon. And you can see here, I changed the name instead of discovery, it says start here. And I actually can change the order of the pieces of content that are in that area. And also I can change the global features in different orders. I can rearrange the global features if I wanted to. And I can also, and it automatically saves it there for me. And I can also turn on or off features. Let's say I don't really need to share events with the network because I only have one space. So I can turn events off. Maybe I want to um, turn off the member list because the members list is already in a different location um, to like eliminate duplication, right? So now we have two things here instead of the four. Now we have just begin here and begin here really is, is to help people get a sense of what is here. What is here that I can do? So one of the things here um, that I really like to use is the featured option. You can manage the featured option. And what this means is anytime you have a piece of content, whether it's a post, an article, a video, um, you would want to click on the three dots at the post when you post it and say, add this to, and then you have some options here. You can put it in your welcome section and your featured section, and that's in the specific space, or you can put it in both places, the space and the network. So I don't want to get too deep in the weeds here right now, but, um, one of the things that I think a lot of people I work with um, just don't use is, is that discovery space. I think it's a really great opportunity to showcase what is here. Um, there's some polls and activity. What kind of community are, are you building? I, I want them to answer that question when they come in. So, you know, we've had really great people sharing all of these different communities that they're building. And so that's a way to create, you know, connection with, with members. Um, and then the welcome checklist is something that it actually comes up on their on their um, on their right side as a little icon as well as in the begin here space. So if you wanted to manage the the welcome checklist, you can actually see here you could add additional things. You can even add spaces. You can add the invite them to the network, download the app. Those are the things that I have in there. Um, and then you can also manage, uh, you can view the preview of what it looks like. So here's what it looks like when you come into my community, this little icon will pop up on the right-hand side and they'll be able to see, and then it'll take them right to these things. And, and then they'll be able to, to view them. So I think the onboarding is one of the biggest things that I talk to clients about all the time. And the biggest piece that a lot of people miss is using, you really utilizing this this, um, be, you know, this discovery area, I would definitely change the name because sometimes people don't understand what discovery means. So I usually say, begin here, start here, um, you know, something else <laughs> than discovery, because I think that's what confuses a lot of people. So I would just, um, I wanted to keep these videos really short. So there's one about the discovery area. Mm -hmm.